Thanks for having me. I'm a little intimidated being in front of all of you wonderful people and businesses, but I'll talk quickly and I'm here to represent other great organizations in Des Moines and across the state of Iowa. So our program works with six different communities in Iowa to build local food systems and help design different projects. And we believe that in order to address those, we want to dream big and really understand all of the different opportunities that exist. And I believe we can all agree that food is a primary right that we all have. And so our goal is to create creative place-based initiatives for us to grow our own food. We also believe that it is important for us to come together to do this. So I'm up here representing all of these organizations that have been partnering together throughout the state of Iowa and in Des Moines. So our goal with ag urbanism is to first start and bring together local food stakeholders that exist and then to promote and build tactic projects and programs to address those problems or opportunities that are already there. We work with multiple scales of agriculture. This includes community gardens, backyard gardens, food hubs, local food systems of all scales to help improve food security, resilience, social equity. We work on a three-phase project. So we work with a process to help build these coalitions. We help install and implement programs and projects around local food systems. And then we also research these projects and best management practices around the nation. We're working in these six communities, Cresco, um, a coalition of counties in Northern Iowa called Healthy Harvest, Dubuque County, Cedar Rapids, Des Moines, and Cass County. So as you're listening, please think about these different areas that you can get involved in. So in Des Moines, our goal through this local food stakeholder um, ag urbanism coalition has been to build a network of local food systems. And so as we've moved forward, we've come up with several different tactics from small, medium, and long-term goals and strategies. The first thing I want to highlight is our partnership with Eat Greater Des Moines. They have a long-term existing local food stakeholder meeting that meets quarterly. And I'm really excited that the agribinism coalition is going to be merging with them in December. This allows for a really great opportunity for these leaders to continue to discuss different projects that can be facilitated. We're working with an awareness campaign. And as you'll notice on the top of each slide, all of our partners are listed. I'm going to save you guys some time and not talk about every partner. Um, so we're trying to create some creative strategies and fun strategies to promote public health and local food systems. We're also working on a garden education program with botanical gardens and several other programs to understand the educational needs around community gardens. So this is not a annual event that will happen regularly. This is a one-time opportunity for public discussion. Uh, we're looking at a public edible landscape in Viva East Bank, and that was mentioned earlier with the housing project. Our goal here is to provide local food access for all individuals. So as you walk through this space, you could pick an apple, you could have a garden. Um, we're also looking at this to be a healthcare therapeutic space as well. And most of these items are in conceptual phase, so there's opportunity for these to be flexible as we move forward. The Eat Greater Des Moines program also has a food box project that they've been working on, and our role in this has been to do the design and development of the experiential piece of this project. So they just finished their pilot program um, working with Principal and Easter Seals, and now they are moving to the Iowa Food Co-op, and they will be doing additional aggregation for 60 to 80 boxes with local businesses. Their goal in the spring of 2016 is to merge into the Des Moines Arts Building and to build up to 500 boxes. So if your businesses are looking for ways to support wellness and your local food system, this is an awesome opportunity to receive boxes to your businesses that are aggregated from multiple producers around the Des Moines region. The last project that we've been working on is a public market and urban farm. And we've looked at two different sites in Des Moines, one in the East, uh, East Village area as well as downtown. And the goal of this site is to be a multi-story building where the first floor, there we go, <laughs> will have a public market space. So if you're familiar with Cedar Rapids, Nouveau City Market, um, or other public markets, this is an awesome opportunity for culinary entrepreneurs to have space and vending opportunities. We would also have a multi-story um, urban farm location. So it could be aquaponics, hydroponics, vertical farming, and rooftop farming. Maybe some goats. That was from Growing Power in, the, in Milwaukee. Uh, so last, I would just like to invite you all to get involved. Again, if you have businesses that work statewide, we do have a coalition that 
is working around the clock to in incorporate different projects, and then there's also clearly some opportunities in Des Moines to, and we'd love your expertise at the table. Thank you.